Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Julie with Bookshelf by Julie. So today I'm going to show you some of the progress I'm making in the Lady Mary uh, journal. Uh, I wanted to make sure this journal doesn't get forgotten by me or anybody else because it's really pretty. So I'm working on uh, the second signature. I finished the first one up and the third one is just going to be a small writing signature. Just I'm not going to embellish it. It's just... Um, the writing pages front and back you know that kind of thing so this one when i finish this one up then i'll start working on the cover and put this thing together what i'm working on today is the centerpiece for this one you know in the other one i did this fold out fold out thingy well i didn't want to repeat myself i mean i almost did because you know but i didn't so this is this is a couple of belly bands I wanted to keep things simple. As you know, I've had the dreaded nasty COVID and then I wasn't well from that. And I got the flu and it was a nasty one too. And I'm not well from neither one of them now. But anyways, moving on. I wanted to keep it simple and easy and pretty. So that's what I'm doing today. Simple and easy and pretty, okay? So I'm gonna use these things up first because if I don't, I'll lose them and get frustrated with myself so i've got this signature and i'm going to work on the centerpiece here and i know everything's lumpy bumpy because i got stuff you know maybe i should do the back of it and then do the center that's what i'm going to do okay let me move this out of the way um because i'm going to do these backs and then i'll do the front i mean the oh you know what i mean the center okay so these, I'm going to do, this is a pocket, of course, so let me get my stuff together. I wanted it to be right in here-ish, right? And I got me a few little things out. I put some lace behind this uh, uh, wooden heart with some roses on it. This embellishment that I made, <laughs> it's one of the fussy cuts from the kit. It's uh, that one. Okay, so I'm going to have it like it's hanging here, right, it, you know, because there's a little um, thing like it's hanging from something. So instead of just gluing that down, I'm going to um, put this through there with my little, my little hole thingy. So I'm going to make me a mark, I think, so I know where to do it. Okay, right there. Okay, and then I can just make me a little hole, hopefully. Um, I know you probably can't see what I'm doing, but I'm making a little hole <laughs> with my little hole puncher. Yep, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to put this on here uh, like so, but I'm going to glue it down. <laughs> I'm, it's not really going to hang there. I mean, come on. That wouldn't hold it very long. We want quality, right? So, I'm going to glue this down, and then I'll put my brad right there, okay? Just a second. I haven't used my glue today, so we're living on the wild side. But, you know, <laughs> it's life anymore. Uh, now... If you guys get sick, I do hope you get well quick. It takes me forever when I get sick, so I always stay at home. And I don't get out. I be a good girl. I stay at home and and do my crafting and all that kind of stuff, you know? But even though you do that, it can still get brought into you. So, just saying. There. There. And it's hanging off a little bit down here, which is fine. That's what I wanted. Uh, so, we've got that. Hopefully, that's going to... It's going to take a minute. I've got lace underneath this heart. So, yeah. It'll grab. And then, we put our bread. I'd order me some more of these little bit, guys. I don't use them very often because I hoard them. And then... <laughs> And then I think, oh, I should be using those. And then I think, oh, now i got to order some more of those. You know, it's, I don't know, a vicious cycle. I don't know. It is. Don't judge me. That's mucky, I know. But 
you know, it is what it is. Okay, now I need one of those. Um, de -dum -de -dum. I need a circle punch. You just keep, you know, scraps around for just that kind of a thing, right? Usually, I'll go ahead and uh, do a lot of them. If I have some scraps laying around that I'm not going to use for die cuts or whatever, I'll, I'll just punch circles. <laughs> Does that make sense? I mean, it will, you use them. And when you're using something like that, you, you do use them. So, so there's my decorated pocket. Did I have a word for this one? I did. I had a word, one of my little words. I think this is printed out small, but anyways, it's from the kit. Okay, so I'm going to put it down here, and it says hope. <clears throat> That's what I have for this new year, is hope. I want good health for everybody, you know, peace on earth and kindness abounding. That's... I'm hoping I can hope, right? Okay, where's my, here it is, here's my reach. I'm gonna put my pocket on there now. Okay, but I wanted to make sure I get this journal finished. I've got another kit that's coming along, I'm just about finished with it, and I'm excited to get started on it, but I don't want this one to get forgotten. It's just too dang pretty to to forget. So, we're not going to forget it. We're going to finish this journal. It's going to be a big one. Uh, so, I'm going to have to hunt me up some chipboard. Look at here. That's why I was going to do that first. Watch yourself. Okay. Now, let's get this on there. Uh, yep, don't get into the sticky stuff. Okay, but yeah, I hope you guys are having some good crafty fun. Uh, even when I don't feel good, I love to craft because, I don't know, it, it kind of distracts my mind. Does that make sense? <laughs> it does with me. Um... It, it helps me um, feel better. <laughs> I don't know. I guess I'm my own kind of weird, but yeah, that's, that's the way it is. Okay, and of course you know I had the double stick glue on here because that's how I roll. So, this is, all this stuff is from the kit. I have a, a thing I'm doing with, uh, oh, and I have a freebie today too. Yep, I do. <laughs> okay. I'll roll that in a minute. Okay, that's on there. Pretty. Okay, now let's get this other side done so that I don't have any lumpy bumpies underneath what I'm going to be doing next. I've got a lot of plans. I'm trying to finish it up. You know, like I said, trying to finish it up. Okay, I wanted to put few little things on this pocket because it's you know it's cute and all that so I'm gonna put my well there I think yeah and then there's my there's my little raccoon and then I'm gonna put peace here and uh, acorn there how about that works for me okay so I inked all these things up already so uh, with uh, Vintage Photo Distress Oxide, which is generally my go-to, you know, thingy that I use. So, um, yep. Do you guys do crafting when you're sick? Um, not feeling well? I have stuff in there in the living room where I sit. 
it's almost like having another craft room. I have a, a, a rolly table that comes up to where I am. Um, and I have my laptop there and I have um, my, uh, work, you know, all my paraphernalia for crafting and stuff like that right there. And I sit there and watch TV and and craft and like I said you got to distract your mind when you don't feel good you really need to not think about that you don't feel good or I I need that so I distract my mind and it helps me feel better it works for me <laughs> okay so that's what I did um, all day yesterday <laughs> it's sad but, you know, I, uh, it's not sad. It's, it took me all day to get ready for doing this little video. Because I didn't feel good. So there. Okay. We're going to leave a little space between. And just stick that down like so. That's so pretty, I think. Um, this, this kit has a lot of pretty to it. That's why my grandmother would have loved it. And that's why it's called the Lady Mary. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I have the creeping crud in my lungs. So, yep. <laughs> okay. There we go. Put this one off. Yeah. I wanted to give something really pretty, do something different. Each signature is unique, even if they're in the same journal. They, I mean, they don't have to be exactly. They can be matchy-matchy. I like matchy-matchy. I do. But, I don't know. I just wanted it to be a little different on this one than it was on the other one. So, yeah. Okay. Let me give this a good roll. And that. I think it looks good. Okay, now we've got that together, so now we're going to work on this side. <coughs> Excuse me again. <coughs> I'll breathe in a minute without crackling and junk. Okay, so this is what my plan is. <laughs> um, this is the, uh, the page where you, you have the three large belly bands in the kit. So I'm using this... Oh, don't do it upside down. My word. Okay, so I'm using these as belly bands, of course. And what I'm going to do, um, I'm going to do this one first. And then I'll show you what I'm doing with that one. Okay. So on this one, it's a simple belly band that's going to go here. And I've got these little, little pockets. They're just, they're... They're a little expandable. I only put one expandable in it, okay? Um, but I thought there, and I marked it somewhere. <laughs> there, <laughs> uh, and then this one up here. And I thought I'd show you how to make this one. It's really simple and easy. We've done these lots before. Um, oh, and this is the freebie. <laughs> I made the inside the pockets with the freebie. It's this... Uh, this image that I put a whole bunch of things together and um, then I just made it smaller and filled the page so it's mushrooms yeah <laughs> uh, it's it's I think it's pretty so I'll put that on the website and on the Facebook group so you can uh, so you can have that one so yeah I made the insides I double side printed with the background page um, you know, just the vintage page. Look, so you just, hopefully I was in shot. You just glue, you glue your gussets to your flat side. Pretty simple. Um, and then, and then you set it in here, right? Get it sort of, you know, in place. Yeah. And fold that up. 
fold this down. I'm not going to use the tape on this one because it's just a little bitty ditty thing and I'm just, you know, doing that. So you just hold it in place and and hold it there for a second. Yada, 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 you know. Um, and then, you know, do the same thing on this side. You don't see much of the paper because the pockets are mostly hidden. But it's in there. <laughs> it's in there. I know it's in there, so that makes a difference, right? <laughs> okay, anyways. Anyways, so um, this is uh, some more of the, the little freebie paper that I cut out. I'm just going to put it on the front. I just cut it to fit. Look, if you're doing this um, little uh, belly band thing on something that you're doing, just, you know, make them fit. Make them fit whatever you're doing. Just uh, have it, have it, uh, whatever size it is, how big you want it on your belly band. And just go with that. You don't have to measure a whole lot doing that way. You just mark it and go. Yeah. So now I've got one for here. I just wanted it to be cute. Yep. Just wanted it to be cute. Little mushrooms. If I can hold on to this, it'll be better. All right. Now. Uh, sure, I had to do that. Because, you know, I'm all kinds of special on that. Okay. All right, now, sheesh, okay, give that a roll, okay, now, as you see on this one, on both these, I had the lace underneath, so that's what we're going to do now, it doesn't take long if, if you think, oh, lacing is just, it takes forever, it really doesn't, um, you just, Especially on something this small. It's just a little uh, a little bit of something. But it sure does look pretty. And these journals, um, a whole lot of times, become a keepsake type thing. You know, uh, um, a special uh, something that somebody keeps for an age and a day, right? So... If you can do so, some little something like this that just makes them extra special, uh, why not, you know? It's, uh, <clears throat> you know, it's just pretty. And if somebody gives it as a gift or, or if somebody buys it for themselves to put some special memories in or whatever, You've, you've given them, you've built it to be strong, sturdy, and pretty. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, I'm going to put this all the way around, and just, yeah, it doesn't take long. And then it'll be pretty and it'll be finished. We have one strip that we do in the front, just on the flap. Um, and uh, that'll be that'll be our our finish of this. Well, I still have to put the velcro on. <laughs> uh, yeah, I thought about using magnets, and then I thought no. Number one, magnets aren't as reliable. Um, they're more difficult to fix back if they come off. Uh, and they're a little thicker than... The Velcro dots aren't very thick, so just saying. So that's what I'm going with, is the Velcro. All right. Now I'm going to take this off here, somewhere here, and glue that down. I always give my end a little bit extra, just so it stays in place, right? Uh, and then squash it real good for a second, because you're doing um, the lace to lace, and that's a... Um, 
kind of like a fabric to fabric situation with, with the one I'm using because it's uh, crocheted lace all right so now that's really pretty and we're gonna just put some across the across the top here of the flap yeah I want to get this one finished so that I can say oh look I have a ta-da you know that kind of thing um, it'll be a pretty ta-da you get a, a nice smooth edge on this. Um, okay, so we want, come on. Yeah, I wanna get it finished so I can move along to the next adventure. Oh, the next one is gonna be beautiful too. I have been so excited about it, even through terrible sickness <laughs> it's been awful anyways um, okay now we've got that we may as well go ahead and get our our velcro going I'm I got me two out this is the top and the bottom together I got me two out because I knew I was gonna need one and a half <laughs> go figure um, you know come on leave go okay now um, yeah, you need one and a half for this job. So, I'm going to put it, come on, right up here at the top. And then peel off the, yeah, that. No, don't put it on my desk. Put it in the trash because you know what? That would be found a million years from now. And, oh, look what she did. Okay, so now I've got my Velcro. And it's going to be, you know, a little pocket there that you can put little notes or what have you in there, or pictures or whatever you want to put, right? And now we're going to put our tape on the back because we're going to make it a pocket on the back as well. Top, top. Okay, so, yep, quick and easy. Then, we'll move on to the other one. The other one, I'm just stacking stuff. Um, yeah, but, I don't know. I sat there in my sick, convalescent self, trying to uh, do some crafting and watch Hallmark Christmas movies. <laughs> I mean, you know, come on. <laughs> hey, there was one that was really good, too. I liked the mystery on at Mistletoe Manor. Something like that was the name of it. It was really good. Okay, let me move this out of the way. All right. Now, oh, I still got to put those ones on. Give me this again. Come on. Uh, there. Okay. Um, there was like a, um, a mystery they had to solve. There was some kids in it. I like it when they have the kids in it and it makes the story better. <laughs> or I think it does. Okay. Let's get this one on here. And... Peel this off, hopefully. Mm -hmm. Okay, in the trash. Yep. Okay, now I only need half of this. And I'm going to have to put it in a safe and secure location. <laughs> okay. Get back on there, you silly. All right, now, this is going to get folded over like that. I don't know. Do you guys do that? I just have to save them because if I don't, then I'll need a half, and then I'll be doing the same thing again, thinking, ah, oh, I should have, you know, saved that. 
Okay. There, without sticking my head in the camera. All right. And peel. No, peel this. All right. I'm using my pokey tool because I want that off. Okay, now. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing or not. <laughs> I'm just trying to keep the the top and the bottom, the fluffy and the scruffy together so that so that when I put them down, see the scruffy's down here and the fluffy's up here. That's my way of I don't know. It's how I do it. It's how I think of it. <clears throat> I did say I'm my own kind of weird many times. So there you go. Okay, so I'm gonna put one down here. Let's get on with it. Um, and it all has to go down at the same time. So, um, yeah. If at all possible. Sometimes with this narrow tape, you've got a little bit of a problem, even on something that's not problematic. But, it's still worth putting it in there, I think. Okay, top. Gives you a little bit extra. Mm -hmm. Or I think it does. So, sometimes it's all in what we think, huh? All right. We get this one here. Like so. That is just darn cute. Give it a minute. Because, yeah, it's it's thickness. It needs a minute. <laughs> okay. Then. Yeah. Then we do the next one. I've got my mark right here and right here. I wanted to have an inch between the pockets. I wasn't really measuring how much from the top to the bottom and all that stuff. I just wanted an inch in between the pockets so that if you want to put something in there, it's not so difficult to do. Put it in and uh, still have room to take things out and in, if that makes sense. So, anyways, that's that was my thinking on that. Hey, okay. So, we get this on. That is the top. Okay. I try to hold on to the place I don't need to glue. <laughs> it helps me. I don't know if it... Do you guys do that? Does you hold on to the place you don't need to glue? Because that's what I do. Okay, where's my mark? Uh, okay, yep, that's my mark. All right, right there so it's a pocket in a pocket yep it is <laughs> uh, okay hold it a minute let it grab <coughs> excuse me uh, yep creeping crud in the lungs <clears throat> Okay, nice. All right, one more, and then we're on to the other one. Then I'm going to try and finish this signature up. I've got some other cute little pocket ideas and stuff. And then I'll start working on the... I can't wait to get the cover. I've got ideas and thoughts and plans and stuff, but I don't have... Um, I don't have the whole thing uh, sorted out yet, so it's still in the works, if, if that makes sense. Uh, I know I'm going to put fabric over some chipboard. I got that part of it figured out. <laughs> uh, I've got, I don't know, gobs and gobs of fabric that I have to go through. and. And pick out just the right one 
I know it's going to probably have to be a floral because, yeah, oh, this is very florally. Okay, where's my next mark? It's not easy to see. I don't make big marks, so I don't have to worry about if they're covered or not. So, yep. Okay, is that straight? Yes, it is. Okay, now we have our pocketed belly band. They're always cute, right? Simple and easy. Yep. <laughs> uh, okay. Now, we'll lay that one to the side and let it be, you know, figuring its life out here while we do this one. Now, this one I've done partially. It's got this part of the belly band lace in behind it like the other one. Then I took the freebie and um, I put lace behind that one and it's going to sit inside the frame of that. And then I took the background page, this, and I put a strip of the freebie. Can you see that? Up the middle. This is a three quarters inch and this is a quarter inch. And this is, what did I say that was? <laughs> I didn't write it down. This is an inch and a half. <clears throat> I don't know. I think it's an inch and a half. Anyways, um, that is going to sit right like so. So, what I thought I would do, now I may go back and put one of my embellishments on the middle. I don't know. I might. So, on this one, I'm going to take this. Let me put this to the side. I'm going to take this and as best I can, I want to use my little, my little hole puncher. And I'm going to put brads on each end. So this will be a little belly band. This will be a belly band. And then there's a big belly band behind it, see? So it's a triple, you know, it's one of those. So, all right. My next big challenge is to get this centered and straight, right? And then get something to hold it still. Yep. Hold it still where it needs to be before I start punching holes, right? Okay, here we go. That's straight-ish, ish. Okay. Uh, yeah. Mm, a little bit further down, I think. Yep. <laughs> I'm not being a perfectionist, really. I just want it to be straight, daggone it. Okay. So, where'd my pencil go? I'm burying things underneath all my crafting. Okay, so I want it to be right here and right here, I think. We're gonna go for that, okay. Once again, I know you probably can't see what I'm doing but I'm poking a hole with my little bitty tiny hole puncher. Like so. Okay. And like so again. I'm just lining, there's a little bitty, like a little nub, the little thing that pokes the hole. This part, if you can see, I just line that little bitty part up with where I want to poke the hole, and then I do that. So, uh, yep, there. And before anything moves, put them in there, right? Okay. Now, we're going to do that, not on the lace, like so. Okay, and get this. I like to make sure that it's down there and being secure, you know. Okay. Now I need a couple more holes. Yes. I'm pulling scrap from the 
from the trash. That's fine because it works. Um, you know, I'll get me. A, I have some somewhere, but you know what? I don't feel good, so I'm not looking for them. <laughs> I'm just doing what I'm doing. Uh, okay, let me get that off there. I just want to cover the so that it doesn't catch on anything when somebody puts something through there, right? <laughs> yeah, I have a whole pot of them somewhere, a little bowl dish or something full of circles of different sizes because, yep, when you have scrap, I mean, you know, do something with it. I, I do. I don't like to have scraps hanging around. I will throw them away. Because I don't, you know, I don't like them uh, hanging around. I don't have room for them. They just jumble up my life. Okay, so now we're going to put this on here. And we have, um, should I put tape on there? I should. Let me get my, I'm going to get the little bit thicker one here, like so. Yep. Because, yeah, like so. All right. On this one, I just have to make sure I don't put it upside down. I mean, <laughs> I can do stuff like that. I am so, so talented. Um, I really can. I'm good at it. Okay, so... It is directional. This writing is directional, of course, but the mushrooms are also directional, okay? So, it's gonna sit on there, and I'm only gonna do one end at a time because, yeah, my my precautionary measures, you know, as soon as I can get the tape to peel off. I hope you guys don't get too bored with me. I'm doing the best I can. <laughs> uh, I'm, uh, Trying to keep my little my little channel going during the COVID season. <laughs> I've never had COVID before, and it's uh, I've been so careful. Uh, okay, I think I think uh, is that straight? It is. Okay, <laughs> I'm like, wait a minute. Uh, straight enough already. Okay, let me give that a good roll. All right. Now, this kit also has some really pretty journal cards uh, that you just have to cut out and put in there. So that's what I'm going to do with that. So, yeah. Uh, lots of really pretty ones. There's some that have little quotes from uh, Louisa May Alcott, the writer of Little Women. Um... And, uh, so I, you know, I like, she's one of my favorites, so. Um, yep. So I will be putting lots of, uh, journal cards, and they'll fit. I mean, this, it's flat, and it'll keep things flat. Um, it won't be too dimensional. Anyways, it's, it won't be too bad with, uh, putting, you know, putting it together. Hell, where'd that go? Hey, here it is. Maybe. Yep. Okay, now we're going to put this together. For real. Okay? <laughs> Center spread. That's pretty. And you can also do, you know, you can do stenciling. You can put embellishments. But it's going to have so many journal cards. There's going to be journal cards in, beh in behind here, behind here, behind here, and behind here. I mean, you know. It's going to have a lot going on. So, anywho, let's do this. Uh, one end at a time. <laughs> oh, my word. I'm still um, brain boggled from the, from the COVID. So, yeah, it's uh, kind of complicated. Okay, I want it in the center. As 
a good belly band should be, right? <laughs> All right, without sticking my head in the camera. <laughs> I try really hard not to do that because uh, you want to, when you're crafting, you want to look at, you want to get over it, you know, and, and uh, yeah, the camera's there. <laughs> okay, so there's that one. Let's get this one off and we'll move on with our lives. I'll go back to crafting in yonder and watching Hallmark movies. Oh, if you guys haven't seen that one, watch it. It's really a good one. Mystery on Mistletoe Lane. Mystery on Mistletoe Manor? It's something. Mistletoe something. Okay. So, Mystery on Mistletoe. It's these, this lady's divorced and she's got a couple of kids. Um, her ex-husband's a real tool. But anyways, she meets a really nice new guy. <laughs> uh, which, you know, Hallmark. But um, uh, the man has a mystery. And it's really cool. They have to solve the riddles and find the little um, reindeer. And uh, in the end, it's really cool. I thought, wow. Uh, well written. Um, not, you know, not such a softy. <laughs> uh, it's really good. I enjoyed it in my COVID convalescence. Just saying. Uh, okay. Now, make sure I'm... Oh, I didn't even look. Yeah, it's okay. Whew. Make sure I'm right side up. Okay. Yep. I try my best. Okay. There. But yeah, I just thought, you know, something easy and simple when I'm needing something easy and simple. This works. Stacking that up. And I came out with a freebie for you guys too, so that's all, all good, huh? I hope you guys like it. It's I don't know. I like it. I think it's pretty. It's not something grand and glorious, but <laughs> anyways. <laughs> it's uh, I like it. It goes with what I'm doing so yep yeah 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 okay now make sure I'm straight put that down yeah it's working okay and I'm running out of every little bit of steam I had so I'm gonna go rest <laughs> and convalesce some more <laughs> um do some more uh, crafting in yonder. Isn't that pretty? Uh, and then I have other plans. You know, I've got other things that I'm going to do, but I just don't have wherewithal to do them right now, so I'll go rest. Um, so you guys have fun. Make you some of these. You don't have to have the Lady Mary to do this. You can, you can make this with any kit. Uh, you can use my freebies and some background papers. Whatever you want to do, you know, just do. <laughs> um, you've got the big belly band here, big belly band here. Then you've got a, another belly band there, and then you've got a belly band there to put really pretty things. So I think it's cool. <laughs> All right, I gotta go rest before I fall out and stuff like that. So <laughs> you guys have fun. Please take care. Don't get sick. Just don't do it. Don't do it. Thanks for watching. TTFN.